and they're all. Lightning Runner and Moonlit Shadow, the two that had the best beginnings. Alpine Moon is away in third, and then comes the Grey Juba's Parade. Seneca Rocks and the Sky is Falling takes up her usual position at the back of the pack, spotting the leader about seven lengths as they hit that clubhouse turn. Lightning Runner from her rail position out to set the pace, but Moonlit Shadow will stick right with her. She's just a length back in second. And then it's another three and a half to Alpine Moon, who now moves up outside of Juba's Parade. The sky is falling out of last, and that relegates Seneca Rocks at the back of the pack, and she now is seven lengths from the top as they head up the back stretch. 23 and 3, the pace is honest. Lightning Runner, the odds on favorite on top by a neck. Moonlit Shadow doing just that, shadowing the favorite as they head for the far turn. Juba's Parade and Alpine Moon continue as a team. Third and fourth, the sky is falling, is called on for run. Has to go from there. She's now eight lengths away. And the trailer, Seneca Rocks. The opening half mile in 47 seconds flat and Lightning Runner shaking free from Moonlit Shadow, who's now three lengths behind. And then comes Juba's Parade, Alpine Moon. The sky is falling, finally starting to hit her stride, but still a long way away from Lightning Runner, who comes down to the 16th pole in charge by four. Lightning Runner's on top from Moonlit Shadow. They'll go one two all the way around lightning runner wire to wire by two and a half moonlit shadow second the sky is falling and juba's parade